Hello, Scorpio, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So, Scorpio, just checking into the energy for February, right? What's coming towards you in February? What spirit wants you to know? Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. And thank you, Scorpio, so, so much for all of your support, um, all of my subscribers, everyone new here. I keep picking up on somebody who wants to take a motorcycle out. Um, here's the thing, and I was just thinking that myself. I'm like, it is really super nice outside, you know? Um, I'm feeling spring in the air, and maybe somebody is like kind of chomping at the bit to take their bike out. Um, I don't know if that's you or someone else's energy. Okay, just take what resonates, Scorpio. All right, so Spirit, what messages do you have for Scorpio? Messages for Scorpio. Yeah, see, somebody wants to go outside and feel the wind in their hair. Okay, that's just the feeling I'm getting. Like, I don't know if maybe you have a motorcycle or somebody else does. You know, this this is giving me the springtime vibes, okay? <sighs> yeah. You know, and somebody here, they can't stop thinking about you. They're very obsessed, okay? Look, um, yeah, they're in love with you here. They want another chance with you. You're moving on. Um, you could have recently bought a new car. I don't know what the deal is with vehicles in your reading here. I'm, I'm picking up heavy motorcycle vibes, new car vibes, open window vibes, wind in your hair vibes, that kind of thing. Um, you're in this earth angel energy where you're very balanced, you're moving forward, you're having this victory, Scorpio, and somebody is obsessively thinking about you, wanting another chance with you. You're in earth angel energy. You're over this person. You're closing out a cycle. This is a good, strong Scorpio cutoff, okay, for real. It's a good, strong Scorpio cutoff, and you're putting yourself out there. Uh, moving forward here. And somebody is, uh, I feel like they're upset. You could even have posted something on the internet, um, something that you're posting, right? Reaching around the world on the internet, okay? And somebody is seeing something that you're doing, okay? They're seeing how good you look, man. I feel like this enrages this person. Um, whatever you're posting out there, whatever they're because they're watching you they've been watching you okay scorpio and they're seeing you moving on they're seeing you looking beautiful maybe somebody i don't maybe you're doing what they want to do you know let's just say um say they want to take their motorcycle out and can't but they see a picture of you on the back of somebody's motorcycle you know or taking your bike out or a new car or something like that you know they're very jealous very jealous you're in this empress energy you've got this person blocked i feel like you're looking good too if they see pictures of you you're looking so good in those photos i'm telling you and everybody can see it hold on a second my cat oh there he goes you okay potato you okay tate Okay, sorry. I usually help him, and I wasn't there for him that time. All right, so he's good. He's good, everybody. All right, so, um, yeah, you are blocking this person out. Um, maybe you're, you think you have them blocked on social media. If you think you've blocked them, think again, collective. Think again, Scorpio. This person is still watching you, probably under a fake profile. I'm getting the sense that, um, oh yeah, ooh, you have a secret admirer. Scorpio, somebody is watching you. I feel like this is a secret admirer. They're keeping themselves hidden. They are wanting to talk. Um, you know, you may even be like dating online. This could, this could be you online dating and your person sees you on a dating site and it, and it lights their fuse. Like, for real, they get furious. So it could be something like that. 
Um, but yeah, you have an admirer here. They're about to approach you and tell you, um, well, they want to get to know you. You may already have met somebody new who's like falling in love with you. Okay, King of Cups, the moon. Is this somebody that you've already cut out? Or maybe this is something that they're worried about getting rejected. Okay, I feel like they're worried about your rejection. What, like, they're, see, they're in King energy, but they're, this person may not be very sure of themselves because they are approaching you. You make this person weak in the knees. Scorpio, I'm feeling like this is somebody new. Yeah, who's afraid to talk to you, who's afraid um, they don't know what to say. They're afraid that you'll reject them. Um, they don't know how to act. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to, what to say. They definitely want to get together with you, though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm I'm giggling because you do make this person weak in the knees. Like, they get shaky because you're just so awesome. This could be somebody that you see, like, maybe pass by every day, okay? It could even be someone at your work, but you pass by them, and they watch you. They just watch you walk, the way you move. The way you smell, your hair, it's everything, okay? You may see this person, okay, so this could even be somebody like a neighbor. And you're out walking your dog, okay? And they watch you from a window. They stay hidden so that you can't see them. But here you are walking past their house, their window. Um, so this could be someone who lives in your neighborhood as well. And they're completely enamored with you, okay? <laughs> Could be somebody very good looking. You know, I'm feeling the intensity off of this person. I kind of get the sense that this is somebody who just doesn't want to, they don't want to hear that you're getting new love. This is this ex. I'm feeling that same fiery, jealous energy off of this person. So I feel like this one here, this King of Wands, you could be dealing with a fire sign, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Um, they do not want you moving on. They don't want to hear about you finding someone new. They don't want to hear about you getting new love. They don't want to hear this. They just, they kind of try to take control of your reading, okay? Yeah, spirits like move away from this person. They don't, spirit doesn't want you with this king of wands. They don't. I feel like they want you with this new person coming in, okay? Um, but this king of wands still has toxic energy. Um, they're And they're very jealous, you know? They're jealous of you, whatever it is that you're doing. They're jealous of whatever it is that you're posting, whatever they're seeing or hearing about you. It's just this person's constantly jealous of you, so they can't come back in. And I feel like they're trying to block the energy of someone coming back, uh, com coming in to meet you, someone new, right? They want to block that, and they can't. Yeah, they're, they're saying you're just too sexy. You're too sexy out here, okay? They don't like it. This is stressing them out, but this is somebody who's having a lot, they're in a lot of regret for walking away from you, okay? Yeah, you're, you're extremely attractive right now. You're in the public eye as well. Um, having a major glow up here, having a huge victory, uh, attracting a lot of attention to yourself and about to meet new love and this this person from your past they can't stand it and they're trying to take over your reading and i won't let them <laughs> yeah you know who this is don't you high priestess energy you're very tapped in very intuitive not speaking to this person not giving them any of your attention Okay, yep, and you're leaving them behind with that beautiful cup of love. You're not offering that cup anymore. There's, there's literally 
nothing they can really do to get you back, especially once you meet this new person. I feel like this new person is going to be your match, okay? We've got the King of Cups to the Queen of Cups. Okay, and I feel like they're about to tell you how they feel or, or start courting you. They're going to ask you out. They're just worried. Okay, they're worried. They're scared. You're making everybody weak in the knees, Scorpio. <laughs> you are, but you're so fine, Scorpio. Look at you. You're just, you're beautiful. Yeah, whoever this is is a manipulator, this person from your past. They, they, don't, they just don't want to let you go. They don't want anyone else near you. Yet at the same time, they are, they're not really wanting to give to this connection either. They just don't want you moving on. And they don't have any control. They, don't, they, they can't control the outcome of your life. And so, yeah, you're leaving them behind brokenhearted. Okay? Feeling like a fool. I feel like this person... Um, they're trying to contact you. You may have this person blocked on your phone. They could be sending you text messages that you're not even seeing. Okay, they could be trying to call you right now and you're ignoring them. I think you know exactly who this is. You're not talking to them. I feel like they've already tried to come back in and you're not answering them. You're just ignoring them. You're disconnecting. You're being silent. You're being told to be silent. Okay? And just keep moving forward. Yep, you have other options. Other options. Yep, the, the Spirit is making a judgment call on this. All right, Spirit is making the final decision on this. Um, this person from your past, they, they're, they need to get their own emotions under control, man. They can't be coming towards you in jealous, toxic energy. And so spirit is making this call like, you know what? We're throwing in the towel on this person. They're not coming back in. We're sending you other options when it comes to love. Here's one of them, you know, and spirit is just kind of scooting you forward. So I feel like the divine does not want you having anything to do with this person from your past. Their intentions are poor for you already. Okay? And they're not coming through really with, with a whole lot of love. They're, they miss you. They have love for you. But their, their main energy is jealousy. Okay? And sabotage. So... Yeah, just keep moving forward, Scorpio, and know that um, you have a secret admirer, okay? <laughs> and you're about to start dating, all right? So, yeah, pick out some dancing shoes. Anyway, Scorpio, that's what I've got for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, Scorpio, take care of you and peace out.